Hi, the Sci-Fi Recapped here, today, I am going to explain the American monster action comedy film called, Monster Trucks, spoilers ahead, watch out, and take care. The film opens at an oil well for Teravex, in the midst of a fracking operation near a lake in North Dakota. Teravex an oil company overseen by CEO Reese Tennyson goes to the well and talks to Dr. Jim Dowd since this well is not pumping oil. The geologist Dowd, informs his boss Tennyson that they detected what could be an ecosystem that could affect their drilling rights. As they investigate the blockage, another scientist discovers a water pocket below the earth that may indicate the possibility of an ecosystem living down there, suddenly the water pressure starts to destabilize. The pipes blow off and release three subterranean creatures from an underground water system and destroy the drilling rig. Tennyson hires a man named Bert to capture the monsters, two are taken in but one of them has escaped and is hiding inside a truck, Bert is almost there but misses the third monster. We then meet high school student Trip. his parents are divorced, now he lives with his mom Cindy and her boyfriend Rick, who is the town's sheriff. Trip doesn't like to stay with his mother and just wants nothing more than to get out of town and do something on his own. He works as a mechanic for Mr. Weathers, where he builds a pickup truck in hopes of being able to leave his town, the truck doesn't have a working drivetrain, Mr. Weathers has brought in the truck that the missing monster is hiding in. At night, Trip goes into the garage to mess around with a truck that he wants to fix up, he sees a news report with his estranged father Wade reporting from near the oil well after witnessing the incident from the previous night. Trip then hears a noise and sees one van in the garage with a hole where the gas tank used to be. At school, Trip rides his bike and talks to Meredith, a girl in his class who is supposed to tutor him, he then runs into his friend Sam, and they see people gathered around another car with a hole in the gas tank. Then the police arrive at the school and Meredith tells Trip that this Friday she will take class. In the garage at night, Trip successfully repairs the damaged engine and hears a growling noise by the oil canisters, he starts searching and encounters the missing monster and hides in the cellar before trapping it in there. He calls for help, leading Rick and some of his men to come by and investigate. However, the monster is gone when they look in the cellar, Rick accuses Trip of lying to cause trouble. At school, Meredith tells Trip that she feels like squeezed here and she wants to leave this place with a scholarship. She also tells Trip about the accident at the Teravex oil field and people are destroying the nature by their bad deeds, suddenly Trip asks her about the biology of an under-earth monster. The next night, Trip gets some oil canisters to lure the monster out, the monster makes its full appearance as a large, cute squid-like blob, it starts to feed on the oil but then nearly gets crushed under a compactor after Trip drops the switch and it breaks. Trip pulls it out in time, although a bit hostile at first, the monster warms up to Trip, and they start to have fun by throwing things at the Teravex truck. Meanwhile, Bert goes to the police station to ask around about the monster since it was reported as being spotted, both he and Rick but heads over their concerns regarding the monster. At the shop, Trip pulls the cute monster on a van, and the creature begins to chase the dog with the help of its tentacles, Trip tries to control it by pulling rope, but the monster throws him in a cellar. Trip tries to keep the monster hidden from everyone, Bert comes by the shop asking questions, though Trip denies that he's seen what Bert and his goons are looking for, after getting them out of the garage, Trip finds Meredith coming by as she was looking for him but came walking. She asks for a ride home, but Trip tells her he can't take her, when the monster, who is hiding in Trip's truck, starts growling and making noises, it arouses the suspicion of Burke. Trip gets Meredith and hops in the truck so they can get out, Burke and his men start following them, and the monster starts to take control of the truck to get them away from the villains. Meredith sees the monster, which Trip has decided to name Creech, She's freaked out at first, but then sees that Creech is harmless, she lets Trip hide Creech out in a stable near her house. Dowd has been doing research on the other two monsters, he determines that they feed off oil and that they are quite intelligent, the creature has hive intelligence, if one creature learns something another one automatically can do the same thing. Trip and Meredith have fun with Creech as Trip decides to use him as an engine for the truck. Trip modifies the truck to fit Creech and to keep him hidden, he and Meredith take Creech out and stop for gas. However, since gas has more chemicals than regular oil, Creech goes wild and starts riding like crazy through town, causing lots of damage to other cars and destroying an entire lot of cars by riding over them. Trip and Meredith stop by where Wade works, Trip tries to talk to him about his situation, but Wade instead sells them out to Burke. When Burke threatens Trip to give up Creech, the monster takes control of the truck. Trip and Meredith hop in, and Trip has Creech ram through Wade's trailer. 
Burke and his goons chase after them, while Rick is in pursuit after they ride into town. Creech manages to climb up the walls and sneak over Rick to avoid detection, the gang hides out near Meredith's house for the night. While Meredith is sleeping, Creech is swimming through the lake. Trip goes there and plays with Creech and overwhelmed by the blue light of Creech, says he loves him and is going to get him home. Back at Teravex, Dowd continues to research the other two monsters, and has even developed an affection for them, but Insane Tennyson says that they plan to poison the well that the creatures came from. Dowd protests and says these creatures are not mindless ground slugs, they have intelligence, they show emotions. It would be unethical to kill them. In the morning, Creech is gone, Trip gets the sense something bad will happen to the other creatures, since Trip left his phone in the truck, Meredith uses an app to track it, it leads them to Teravex, where the other creatures are being held captive. They find Creech has reunited with the other two monsters, who turn out to be his parents. Trip and Meredith get caught while the monsters are captured, and Tennyson erases any trace of the monsters from their phones. Dowd escorts the two out of the building, but he tells them he wants to help them because he cares about the monsters. With help from Sam and Mr. Weathers, Trip gets two more trucks that he and his friends fix up to accommodate the monsters, they modify the trucks for Creech's parents to control, they take the trucks back to Teravex and break out Creech and his parents. Trip, Meredith and Dowd ride toward the oil well above the monster ecosystem as Burke and his goons follow them, Rick gets in on it too, but Burke rams his car down a hill, Rick then gets inside a larger vehicle to run Burke's goons off the road. The three trucks make it to the oil well but the workers have already started to drill down with the poison, Burke tries to push Trip and Creech into a hole, but Creech grabs Burke's truck and flings it into the drilling machine, ceasing the poisoning. Trip and Creech fall into the hole but land in the water. Creech pulls Trip out of the truck, Trip sees the rest of Creech's family as he and his parents rejoin them, Trip says goodbye to Creech. Teravex is exposed by the group for the experimentation that was harming the creature's habitat, Tennyson and his cronies are arrested for their dirty deeds, Trip and Rick are now on good terms and have fixed up the truck to make it look better, Trip and Meredith then go for a ride through town. Monster Trucks is a 2016 American monster action comedy film produced by Paramount Animation, Nickelodeon Movies and Disruption Entertainment for Paramount Pictures, it was directed by Chris Wedge, the film stars Lucas Till, Jane Levy, Amy Ryan, Rob Lowe, Danny Glover, Barry Pepper and Holt McCallany, the film premiered on December 21, 2016 in France. It was released by Paramount Pictures in the United States on January 13, 2017, and received mixed reviews from critics, a box office bomb, Monster Trucks, grossed $64 million worldwide against its $125 million budget.